What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Platinum Walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we went through a blizzard, a literal blizzard to get here, Snow Point City. And, uh, well, in this episode, we're going to be going for our seventh badge. Yes, guys, 23 episodes, seven badges. Can you believe that? Now, there is a hidden item here somewhere, and there it is. We found ourselves a third rare candy in the last three episodes. And just like I said, I really, 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 really hate the snow around here. It's kind of like the Great Marsh. It just, it, it sinks you, and it's just, it makes everything slower. It's like a cruel joke that Pokemon had when they were coming out with these games. So, what I'm going to do right here is I'm actually going to be buying myself a few, uh, you know, a few potions. Because we've been running low on potions as of lately. And, well, let's see. we got to get revives, too, because, yeah, Draven's been a little bit messy as of late, too. And, uh, let's see, what else, what else, what else? Oh, yes, full rest or full heals can actually work, too, so there you go. And, well, it is time. It is time to go to the 7th badge, the 7th gym battle. Now, before anything happens, let's go right ahead and go into the Pokemon uh, Center. Because, uh, well, our good old buddy, Maylene, she's right here, and she's like, <laughs> Oh, hi, Draven. Are you taking, a, or are you taking the gym challenge now? I'm hoping to see Candace soon, but I'm staying to put until I warm up first. Oh, you should know that Candace is a user of Ice Type Pokemon. I really, I really admire Candace. She's so studious. She wanted to practice against me with uh, to learn about fighting types. It's because the uh, Ice Type matches up badly against fighting type Pokemon. Oh, well, that's nice to know. Look at that. Okay, so it's time. I keep on saying that, but you know. It is whatever. So, let's go right ahead and earn ourselves our seventh badge. And let's speed this through because, seriously, the snow is getting all my tits. Let's get it. So, here it is. The uh, Snow Point City Gym. And here's the only man that's ever believed in us. He's like, hey there. How's it going, champ to be? Do you see this, the big snowballs placed here and there? You need to slide down the ice with them in a, with enough momentum to crush them. The ice, uh, the gym leader is a user of ice type Pokemon. Melt her defenses with Scorch and Hot Fire moves. It's all about focus with this gym. Bear down and focus. Okay, so we will be focusing, and well, we need to break these uh, these big old uh, snowballs right here. So let's go right ahead and break some snowballs. And look at that, we broke some snowballs, and we got two battles ready to go so let's go right ahead and speed this up and battle everybody as you guys can see Glalie is a pretty awesome looking Pokemon it's a scary looking Pokemon but still a very awesome Pokemon and just like that we win that's right we are tough tough as nails tough as bricks tough as anything and well here we have three Pokemon and th three Pokemon means snow runs and well let's go right ahead and give some love to Togepi right here since it does have fire type moves and because of that protect, it protects Snow Rump. But guess what? Here comes Glalie again and Flamethrower. Almost for the win. And just like that, for the win. Look at that. Okay, so yes, I know we're speeding through this whole thing, but I gotta I gotta speed through this thing, guys. I really do, because the game itself is slow, and it's this is the number one reason why I just dreaded playing it, because well, it it, it just it just lags. Super laggy when it comes to like, you know, different kinds of uh, areas right here. Now, here we are taking on Snover, and it beat the crud out of us right there. So let's go straight to Togepi, going with a flamethrower, and that is quadruple damage. And here comes a Sneasel, so again, wow, we're getting our butts kicked right here. So let's go Poseidon, let's go with a Surf Attack, and go with the Rock Smash right here. And just like that, we went with a very, very weak... Uh, Weak HM right there, so let's go right ahead and let's go ahead and revive our Pokemon because, well, you know, we're good trainers like that. And thankfully, we did, thankfully, we did get ourselves quite a few, uh, you know, healing items for all this. So let's go right ahead and waste the super potions and let's go with hyper potions right here and let's go ahead and break some, uh, let's break some snowballs. Look at that, so we broke one snowball right there. And now we have to go towards this area. And again, more momentum means the greater chance you'll break the snowballs. Now, if you get stopped by the by the by the stairs, or if you don't get more than like what five blocks or something, 
Yes, you won't be able to break any of these snowballs right here, guys. So just be aware of all that. So what's going to happen is we're going to have to go up here and break everything. Look at that. We're opening up the entrance for ourselves right there. And we need to take on that one trainer. And, well, that should be... That's easier said than done right there. So let's go right here. And... To go right here. There it is. Okay, so... Let's go right ahead and battle this trainer. Coming out with a Sneasel. Here comes a Brick Break. And just like that, we're winning. And here comes a Snow Run. So let's go with a Flamethrower attack. And just like that, let's go with another Flamethrower attack for the quadruple damage. And yes, we win. Okay, so... Go down here, we break another piece of snow, and now we still have to we still have to battle that one trainer. Okay, so let's see. If we go right here. Let's see, let's see. If we go right here, look at that. Breaks that. And well, let's see. It looks like to me we have to go through towards the edges. The edges, the areas right here, so. Yeah, back then I would have been super confused, but right now it's, you know, it's kind of become clear, you know. Here we go, there's one, two, and three. Oh, nearly broke everything. And we're going to go towards this side right here. And we're going to be facing on one more trainer. And here we go. Brick break for the win. And here comes another Sneasel. So let's go right ahead and go with Toothless, even though, you know, we're probably risking it right here. And Dragon Claw. For the win, and just like that, Toothless grows to level 45. And, well, let's see. I think there might be one more area? Yeah, it's this area right here, and we have to break both those, uh... We have to break both those snowballs. Now, that's usually the that's usually the spot that gets me, so... Let's see, giggity. Right here, and... Oh, we haven't battled this guy, okay! And here comes Piloswine. And let's go with the Brick Break. And Earthquake Attack beats us. Okay, so yes. Uh, we are losing way too much. Let's go with Surf Attack. And just like that, we win. Alright, so let's go right here. Break that down. And now we have to break that one. But how? How? Tell me. I think I know how. It's just uh, I probably missed it. Right here. Right here. And right here. And going down to here. Going right here. Okay, so that... Okay, so what about right here? There we go. And... Huh. You can't really break it like this. So you have to go up top. Towards this area. And... Let's see right here and right here okay so there it is see that guys experience hell yes okay so after doing all that guys you can go you can go straight from the beginning and yeah go straight down the middle so what I'm gonna do right now guys is I'm gonna heal up my Pokemon I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center and I'll be right back with you guys Okay, so, saving up the game, we're ready to go, let's see what she's all about. You want the challenge, Candace? Sure thing. I was waiting for someone tough. But I should tell you, I'm tough because I know how to focus. Pokemon, fashion, romance, it's all about focus. I'll show you just what I mean. Get ready to lose. Alrighty. Okay, so here it is, guys, gym battle number seven. We are taking on Candace herself, and uh, yes, it is the 23rd episode, and wow, seven epi or seven gym battles in 23 episodes. That right there is unprecedented. Let's go right ahead and take on Sneasel. As many of you guys already know, Sneasel is a very tough, fast Pokemon. Weak against Fire-type and, uh, and Fighting-type, but look at that. We have defeated it easily. And here comes Abomasnow. Abomasnow happens to be Candace's strongest Pokemon. Quadruple damage, quadruple weak against, uh, what was it called, uh, you know, fire-type Pokemon. So this is gonna work, as you guys can see, we messed it up badly with Togepri. Togepri, you are a tank. You're an absolute unit. Anything big, you are it. 
And, well, of course, because of its snow warning, um, a bomb is no snow warning, we're gonna get hit by hail. So here comes a Pilo Swine. This right here will become easier for us going with the uh, Poseidon. So let's go Surf Attack right here. And just like that, we have defeated, uh, you know, Pilo Swine right there. And, of course, we're gonna get hit by snow. And here comes Frostlass, the Pokemon that I've been talking about. It is weak to... Well, it is weak against, uh, you know, Dark-type Pokemon, Fire-type Pokemon. It is a super fast Pokemon. And we're going to be going with a Flamethrower. And here comes a Blizzard attack. That messed us up pretty well. Okay. I'm angry. Let's do it. Gaia, the Fierce Knight. And let's go with a Swords Dance. And we're both increasing everything. And, well, if he wants to go double team... There we go. We're both trying to, like, go double team right here. <laughs> there we go. And there we go. Okay, so now let's go with a Swords Dance. Damn it! Okay. Wow. Okay, so... <laughs> we gotta go with Electro Star just because, you know, it's a Shockwave attack. We'll hit it. And here we go. And... Okay, so... What needs to happen is we got to go with the full restore right here because, yeah, this is going to be a battle. So, the only Pokemon right now that can defeat this Pokemon is, uh, well, Electrostar itself. So, let's go right ahead and do that again. Hyper Potion, Blizzard Attack, hitting us. And I guess it's already over with no more uh, Blizzard Attack. So, here we go, Sh Shockwave. And, wow. Okay, so here we go. Let's go straight for a Surf Attack. And just like that, we have defeated Frostlass. Yeah, that was kind of uh, weird of me to just, like, boost up all my attacks and not hit any Pokemon. Yeah, I didn't see that. So, there it is, guys. We have defeated Candice for our seventh badge. It's like, wow, you're great. You've earned my respect. I think your focus uh, and will <laughs> and will bowl us over totally. Oh, that's right. I'm supposed to give you this. And there it is, guys. Throwing out the peace sign. Yes, we win. Alrighty, so that icicle badge I just gave you, because you have it, you can use the hidden move rock climb anytime, even when you're not in battle. Oh, and take this too. Here we are. We get ourselves the TM72. This move is Avalanche. If the user takes damage, the move's power is doubled. Can you imagine the sort of focus uh, you need to pull it off? Do you think I should try to act uh, more like a nice type gym leader? Like, do you think I should be more cool and distant? That sort of thing I have trouble with. Hmm. Okay, well. Au revoir. Okay, so that is uh, pretty awesome right there, guys. Seven badges. We got seven badges. We're feeling pretty cool. Pretty awesome. Let's go right ahead and shine that some bitch up. Let's go right ahead and uh, click this. And look at that. Seven badges. Yes, we're going to shine this up. Yes, my precious. My precious. Yes, sir. Seven badges, and we got one more to go. Can you believe that, guys? Very astute. Very everything. Yes. I think we should be done with this walkthrough within the next month or so. My goal is... My goal is uh, by, well, by June. And, well, there it is. All my badges, all nice and shiny. Anywho... This has been a good episode. In the next one, we're going to be doing a lot more. Now that we have Rock Climb in our arsenal, I think we got a lot of stuff to cover. So, thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for being patient as always. Thank you guys for making fun of me when uh, doing this, you know, because I'm losing focus. I totally didn't have focus. In the next episode, we're going to be making fun of Barry. So, I hope you're ready for all that stuff. I do have a merch store, guys. You know, if you guys need anything, there it is. Merch store. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Platinum walkthrough. See you guys.